Alright guys, so today we have another O-Gage train car. This one is another Menards Gold Line collection. This is the M&M's Hopper in yellow. I think there's also a blue one. I can't remember what the other color is, but I like the yellow one. It reminded me of the peanut M&M's uh, packaging. You know, it was yellow. Uh, this is a new decal. I guess for 2020, new uh, yeah, new new decal for 2020. The word is not coming to mind. Um, new variation, uh, built by Menards 2020. Now this one I I saw in my uh, classic trains uh, magazine that I got. Menards always has a little advertisement section in that. Um, but I I just got this at Menards. Uh, so that this train is long enough, they usually put the tape over the hole, but you can stick your finger in there and feel that, that coupler on the one side. This side is taped shut like it's supposed to be. And uh, all the Menards uh, train cars that I've seen so far are, have, have this pretty simple, um, just, oops, we lost the tape here. They have this pretty simple, um, plastic casing that they all go into. And it just pops open. Oh, I didn't... I was trying not to stab the train with the, the knife. This one is significantly heavier than the tanker truck that I showed earlier. And um, I'll mention again, Menard's Trains, I think, are the same quality, maybe even a little better than the new Lionel trains. Um, so, and they, they all, the couples and everything hook up the same way. This one's got different trucks on it than the uh, tanker car. Still got those smooth rolling wheels. You can see it says M&M's Chocolate Candies brand. Uh... Built by Menards 2020. M&M's got red and yellow. Got the load capacity stuff going on there. It's got the uh, chutes on the bottom because it is a hopper train. If you'd like to find some like fake M&M's or something and stick in here. I think that would look funny. There's that side of it, or the this end, I should say. I don't usually get the ones that are more novelty, like an M&M's hopper, but um, I like this. I thought it was cool. So I went ahead and picked it up. Um, these, This one and then the tanker that I reviewed just before this, they're, I want to say they were both $20, like a piece. Um, at, at Menards, and then if you get the special ones like, uh, you know, if they're weathered or they're uh, got a, if they're a flatbed train car with a vehicle on them, usually they're like twenty five bucks or something. But they're a lot, they're cheaper than buying a Lionel train car, and um, I think they're just as good a quality. Um. Uh, and you can get them at Menards or on Menards.com slash trains in case I didn't mention that already. So I've shown you the whole train car, but uh, we will uh, get this on the turntable for you and then I'll get it on the track and I'll leave you there. So like, comment, subscribe for more. Have a great day. I'll catch you in the next video.
here in the train room and if you watch the video on one of these and not the other one well you've seen this part of the video already because I'm going to use it for um, the same for both videos so we got the uh, Tide tanker and the M&M's hopper on the figure 8 track and we're going to go over here and we got to plug this thing in first I guess That'd be a good idea. Just turn the lights on, even though we got all the lights that's in here on. Alright, and then this right one is for the, the figure eight. 